Hello everybody and welcome to Great Leveler Gaming. I am the Great Leveler and today we're back with some more trailer. We actually we recently reacted to Silent Hill 2 Remake trailer. <laughs> Blown away! Uh, but we got three more trailers. There might be more, but I've only got three and I'm only going to watch three more because I don't want to just spend my whole day that I've booked off just doing trailer reactions. So we've got three trailers we're going to do in this one. We've got Silent Hill Townfall. I knew it was sounded familiar because I there was one called Downfall. Silent Hill Ascension and Silent Hill F. Um, so we're just going to do one after the other. I might pause and talk about that one if I feel the need to, or I might just do a big summary at the end. We'll see. So without further ado, let's crack on. All right. So this one is Townfall. Why are you here? Ooh, that was very nice. In this place, why are you here? I don't know. You're to be punished. Oh, okay, yeah, that's, that's bad. That's good, I like it. You know what, I think you're right. I mean, we've done something so awful. I don't know. You're stuck here you in this place. Things. Being judged by these people. People? But for you, I think it's more than that. Ooh, this is different. I think you're here for some other reason. I don't want to be anywhere near you. Oh, that looks a bit visceral. Wow, okay, that gave nothing away. So I don't know if these are going to be like traditional games as it is, or if they're just going to be mini games almost. I don't know. Okay, so this one is now Ascension. Uh, again, the last trailer didn't give anything away, so. So obviously with this implication, we're definitely more modern times. Ooh, who are you? You're um, different. Oh, that's uh, kind of like a demagogan. This is gonna be a PVP game? Feels almost like it is. All right, again, that's why I want to do all these trades together because they're not giving anything away except for the kind of monster design. Which is definitely interesting, but also definitely feels like it's stealing from Stranger Things. Bad Robot Games? Is J.J. Abrams doing games now? Ooh, that's a new one on me. <laughs> yeah, it definitely feels like, yeah, it's a, oh, it's a multiplayer game. That is interesting. That has got me... Uh, Intrigued. Okay, so we just got one more trailer. Let's roll the clip. Okay, so the last trailer we are reacting to is Silent Hill F, uh, which is in Japan. Oh, wasn't expecting that. Graphic looks good though. Ooh, creepy. Is it following her or is it because of her? Oh, oh. Definitely Japan with that low angle uh, shot. Actually, that feels like more War of the Worlds. Ooh. Well, what is going off here? Ooh. Well, that is horrifying. Never known a game with plant-based horror. Well, as you count the last of us. Huh. Ooh, ooh. Well, that is visually just beautiful. <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh! <laughs> Whoa. So that's Silent Hill F for flower. Today's Silent Hill is brought to you by the letter F. 
So that is different. So again, that's why I wanted to just do one video for all three of those trailers because I knew they would tease it. I knew it wasn't gonna be much revealed. So it just made sense to just do them all together. So let's talk about Townfall. Don't say, don't know anything about it, obviously. It feels like it's gonna be, I'm, I'm sure there's probably stuff out, people already know all about it. It feels more like there's, how to describe it, more, not like proper gameplay. It almost feels like it's gonna be solving puzzles almost or, I, I don't know, I, do, I can't really say anything. That gave me nothing. Silent Hill Ascension, however, does definitely feel like a co-op game, whether it'll be PvP, and there'll be different Silent Hill monsters that like Dead by Daylight, like you get to play as and chase your friends. That would be actually really cool. Um, obviously, it looks like it's got a unique uh, monster in the trailer. Uh, are the all going to be unique monsters? Is it going to be just a cooperative game? Uh, like, uh, oh, what's that Resident Evil game where you get to play like four survivors and try and make your way through it? Uh, it might be like that. So, but a multiplayer Silent Hill game doesn't sound scary, but it does sound fun. Silent Hill F, now that one has actually got me really excited. First thing I want to say, have you guys ever played Grim Fandango, uh, an old game by LucasArts? Uh, really good, point and click, it's on PlayStation as well if you want to play it. Uh, you play uh, Manny Calavera, who's an undead salesman, so when you die you get taken to the underworld, and then there's this journey of the soul, and depending on how good you lived your life, it depends on the mode of transport from a train that'll take you there in four minutes to a walking stick that's going to take you four years to walk to a car to all this. and it's a really good game it's like a it's like a noir type game where you've got to uh, solve corruption and stuff and it's just a really fun game but the characters are already dead yet they have what's called sprouting uh, and they will shoot you with a gun which will inject something and your bones sprout flowers and that's how you die in the underworld and it's a really like way to make it kid friendly, but still have that sense of peril and loss of characters that die. And that is what Silent Hill F reminded me of at the end with all the flowers sprouting out of it. Great game, Grim Fandango, but that's, that's that with that. Silent Hill F though, that is the one that's got me the most intrigued. Now, say Japan, so has it Silent Hill? Well, my theory is that Silent Hill, if I remember the law properly, this whole thing's with angels and demons and creations, and I think Silent Hill's maybe built on a certain area that's sensitive to it. So that's not saying then that somewhere on the other side of the globe could have similar areas with similar religions that's all connected. So maybe that's how it connects, and it's got you know the same fate as before in it. Uh, the fact that it's like this relentless kind of fast growing plant that's just trying to reach out and grab you is really interesting. Now, how are they gonna frame this game? How are they gonna have it playing? Is it just going to be, rather than a traditional Silent Hill game, more like uh, these uh, Outlast games where you just gotta try and evade and maneuver rather than fight because I don't see how you're gonna fight plants unless you've got a flamethrower. But either way, I have to say, out of all those three trailers, although I do like Look of Sension, Silent Hill F, definitely got me excited the most. I really like Japanese culture anyway, um, so the more games I play based in that kind of location is just great for me. Um, but uh, I'm really, really excited for that one. Uh, I'm not sure what's out. You might have told me I missed it. I don't know. But either way, we are going to have plenty of Silent Hill content coming to this channel in the next couple years so really excited for that hope you guys are as well anyway we're going to call an end to this trailer reaction right here i hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, we'll see you with some actual let's play very soon so until then bye